Here is a uh, technique where you can use to figure out if your power button is working. And this particular test is with the uh, power button built into the keyboard. Uh, you got the uh, power button alongside the keyboard button, so, so not a dedicated one. So what you'll need to do is, with a multimeter, find the pin which has 3.3 volts, the closest to 3.3, maybe 3.28, 3.29, etc. And once you've found this pin, uh, by putting the black black probe on the ground and the red probe onto one of the pins, uh, be careful, you don't want to um, short the pins together, like don't touch two pins together. Be really careful, take your time and try and pinpoint one pin at a time and find the 3.3 volts. And when you've found it, hold on to it, and while you're holding on to it, press the power button and the voltage should drop down to nearly zero. Then you know that your power button is working. So here, it's going to take me a little while here, I'm going to find the 3.3 volts and when I do find, I'm going to keep pressing the power button and see if it does go down to 0.0 volts or nearby there. And if it does, then I know my power button works. So here we go, continue watching. Oh, one more thing, if you have a dedicated home button, a power button, it's much easier. You don't need to find the pin. It's one of usually three or two pins. It's just a matter of putting the um, the positive probe onto the right 3.3 volts on, under the power button. And then when you press the power button, it should drop down to zero. So here, even though I got 3.28 on this particular pin, it's still not uh, uh, going down to zero. Doesn't mean my power button is not working because there's many pins in here, I think 15 or nearly 20 pins. So I'm just gonna keep hunting until I find it. If you have any questions, write in the comments below. I'll try and help you out. Thank you. I think I found it. Here we go. As you see when I press the power button, it drops down to zero volts, near zero volts. And as you can see, this model I've got here, it's faulty one. It won't wake up from sleep function. So uh, I'm trying to fix this problem for a while. Um, it's not turning on, but my power button is working, so I can rule that out. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to support this channel.